Fuck off. Fuck everything. Got another fine today. It wasn't a good day, everyone. Nothing worked out our way. I even ran out of fuel just before. Matthew? How'd you run out of fuel? Well, I saw it beeping and making sounds this morning, but I just went to the gym up the road. But then we had to go to Nando's earlier, and then I was like, fuck. But then there was no fuel station in between there. Well, we sort of skipped the one that we were meant to go to. and then How long was your... A couple of Ks. Bit. Anyway, bad news. Shit day, guys. We got fucking another fine from the police. Well, hopefully, when this comes out, we will... Um, right now, we're planning on streaking in the AFL Grand Final this weekend. Yeah, By holy, the time we can this comes say out, We'll either have done it or we could, couldn't could find tickets and knowing our luck lately, we fucking won't even get tickets there. But we're going to try and kick a goal at the AFL Grand Final. That's the plan. We're Are gonna, you going to take a ball? Yeah, we'll take a ball each. We'll jump the fence and we'll fucking leg it to the goal. <laughs> See if we can... S- Miss all the security and just try and kick a goal. Oh, our parents would be so proud of that. Hopefully, the, uh, the only thing I'm worried about is the players taking us out. Yeah, that's assault, that brother. Would be super embarrassing. Yeah, everyone would be so happy about that. So we're just gonna have to. <laughs> we're gonna be that'll just we're just trying to make one last big fucking video for the end of the year, and that's it. But. Yeah, of course, this morning couldn't fucking get tickets. It sold out within two minutes. So we're going to have to try and scalp some now. And there is actually some good news, guys. Matt, do you want to tell them? No, we're not talking about this. Yes, on the we are. Matt's got hemorrhoids. Yeah. Oh, he's got his first hemorrhoid. I'm so proud of him. He's fucking, he's got cream for it. Who's rubbing the cream on it? Your girlfriend or you? I'm doing it. <laughs> no oh, way. Dude, I could... had this funny thing in the bathroom this morning and I was trying to get the cream on. I was using the mirror from the wardrobe. So, I was in a weird like you yoga You don't need position. a mirror. You just feel the fucking yeah, lump. No, but I want to make sure I got it all. Oh, I never ever put no cream on my ass hole and they just heal up in like a and week or a month. She's in the bathroom and I'm like, do not come out. It'll, you'll see some strange shit going on. Oh, I want to see it so bad. <laughs> he won't show us, guys. I'm so upset. Is it big? How big is it? Yeah, it's kind of big. I was, um, I was at the gym and I was going hard. And then at the gym, I needed a shit. And I shat at the gym after pushing hard on legs. And yeah, I was uncomfortable all day. Is there blood? That was it. There's a little bit of blood. Oh, you lucky boy. Oh, yeah. a little treat to look at in the bowl after. Yeah. Um, yeah, no, you'll be right, dude. Just eat some veggies, they say. It's just not cool to look at or feel or I, I, anything. I'm a fan. I'm a fan of it. It's something different. It gives you something to sort of... Can you show know. us later off camera? <laughs> no. Come oh, on. Please. He I've said no to me before. before. Yeah. She's yeah, I know, mine. but I'm... I'll show you my dick. If you want to see my that's dick? Standard. That's so many standard. Times. Well, I'll show you wh- whatever you want to see, whatever part of me you want to see, I'll show you. Oh, man. I'll think I'm, about it. But still, that's so good, Matt. I'm fucking very proud of you. It's super uncomfortable. Oh, three. Um, but oh, yeah. it's it's not good. It's, it's not it's, a good feeling. It, uh, jump in the comments. If anyone has had hemorrhoids, tell us your thoughts on them. But yeah. for me, it was very uncomfortable. Yeah, they do. Apparently, oh. it's super common. Man, so they probably don't oh. talk about it. Um, oh, um, yeah. Well, there you go. That's the best news. That's the best thing that's happened today. <laughs> Everything else has been fucking shit. Oh, these fucking brand deals. We're never oh. ever doing fucking brand deals again. We got a fine today because we're filming this fucking Borat brand deal for Amazon Prime. And they're like, eh, yeah, just wear this mankini out in public. So we're like, oh, we're going to have to wear underwear underneath it. Otherwise, they won't even be allowed to be posted on social media. And they were like, oh, really? Oh, do you have to wear undies? Okay, then, okay. But like, reluctant on even making us wear the underwear. Wanted us to go out without underwear. Then we wear the fucking underwear. Two scenes in to being out in public. Of course, the cops rock up. We get a fucking fine. We film the police interaction, though, so at least we still have a video. An end to the brand deal video. Send the video to them. Uh, sorry, Amazon's actually liable. So can you remove the police interaction? It's like, so now they expect us to upload this fucking shit half video with no police interaction at the end of it 
so they're not fucking liable. They're fine with us getting fines all the time. I'm, fuck brand deals. We're sorry about the Macca's, doing brand guys. deals anymore. Sorry about the McDonald's And the McDonald's video. brand deal, sorry about that, okay? We needed some money because social media is shit. Times are fucking tough, and but fuck me. We're not doing them anymore. I'm so sick of that shit. Maybe for TikTok, for nothing else. Yeah. Oh, fuck you, Amazon Prime. No one go and watch that fucking Borat movie. No, oh, uh, we'll just, oh, fuck, man. I probably will. <laughs> we love Borat deep yeah, down. Yeah. We just hate the fucking marketing team. Fuck you. God. What's the name of, who does Borat again? Bar- Sasha Baron. Baron. Sasha Baron Cohen. Sasha, Sasha Baron. fucking legend. Yeah, he's a great He gets dude. fucking arrested all the time in the movie. Why would it not suit it to have the promo for that movie to also have some fucking dudes getting arrested? Matt? Which is what happened today. What? What do you reckon? Why? I don't know. People get scared. People get Fuck scared. Fuck people, that. man. It's getting shit. This world's getting real shit, everyone. And it's giving me the shits and Matt hemorrhoids. <laughs> Hmm. Fucking, I should never have told you. You're bleeding from the bum. Um, Can I ask where the security tag came from? What's the deal with that? That wasn't on the table last week. Oh, yeah. Julian bought that today for our Borat brand deal video. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, more money we spent on your shit video that we can't post. That now we have to go and film more scenes tomorrow before they can even submit it to Amazon. God. Oh. So now we have to postpone filming our own videos to fucking add some more clips to them. It's like it never fucking ends. Aren't we just going to fucking ditch it now, though? I don't know. I don't know. Fuck. We are going to come a long way. Anyway. You know, it was one day, but yeah. Fuck dad, man. It's been a fuck dad day. It's been a fuck dad week. Yeah, he just can't. I it's hope hard. to God by the time this comes out, this podcast, we've at least successfully run onto the field the AFL grand and final and hopefully goal. kicked a fucking goal because that would that'd be beautiful pitch yeah baby. but fuck yeah let's just say that we did let's we we have guys no because imagine if we didn't imagine if nothing happened because we couldn't even fucking get tickets yeah and then oh, we sound like dickheads right now planning on running onto the field but we didn't even get fucking tickets to get on I was on the right. fucking ticket ticket master whatever the fuck it's called at 9am when tickets went on sale and within fucking one minute there were no three tickets next to each other fucked up yeah man I wonder how I wonder how that works just give me a fucking ticket I will pay anything just give me a fucking ticket someone just want to get in there god they make it hard. Everything's hard. I think there was... Was it only 10,000 tickets on sale though? No, it was no, like 35. 35. But... W- lots okay. of them... Well, lots of them would have gone to members and shit. Yeah, I thought the and members would have first. Hopefully, the, the members in like Melbourne and shit who can't come, hopefully they start selling their tickets and we can just snap up a couple of them. But fucking hell, it's not looking good. Oh, man. Have you if, checked Facebook just, Marketplace? No, not yet. If we don't do it somehow, guys... Just pretend we did. We just know that we're planning on doing it. It's fucking terrifying. So many things can go wrong and it'll be more police issues and we'll definitely have to go in front of a judge this time. Yeah, we've had, what, two fines now in like a two week? Two public nuisance fines because people are like... The the cops rocked up oh, today yuck. like six paddy wagons so with such aggressive cops because someone called the cops, said that there were dudes running around naked and on drugs. All he had on was a fucking undies and I was pretending to be a security guard chasing him. It's not that fucking bad. Calm it, and down. they were jocks. They were shorts. So it's like I could wear short shorts and that's okay, but I can't wear jocks. What the fuck is going on? Yeah, look at what Underwear wear. actually classes naked. That's what they said to us. And then the fucking cop called us retards. Yeah, what do you call us? It's a fucking- three fucking retards. Yeah, he called us three fucking retards running around making people call triple O. You can't say that these days, even any days, I guess. Matt? Anyway, fuck you, that one cop. The rest were okay. There was just one big dickhead. And, Jesus Christ, And then we got stupid. a really funny video done, the, but we probably won't be allowed to post it on social media because our Facebook page is nearly gone. It's just fucking impossible at the moment. Just nothing is working out. Anyway, we're, we're having a big rant and we're all like, fuck, oh, fuck, I'm so fuck. fucking exhausted. Just so draining. Just having <clears> this <throat> obstacle after obstacle after obstacle. Oh, my God. It's just like, get fucked. I'd rather just go back to coaching. Yeah, dude. Greg? Same. We'll call Greg today, actually. You guys aren't the only ones that are going through it as well. Other people are struggling. 
social media was i think our oh, friend every, maitland they had struggles as well maitland i think someone mentioned that Shami got demonetized maybe i think he might have gotten that back i think that was a mistake but yeah everyone's fucking struggling in social media it's not all bloody it's not all everyone just fucking around all day you know it's it's uh it's fucked it's not easy yeah there's yeah. a lot of rules now guys you don't know where the next paycheck's coming from that's for fucking sure and it certainly isn't coming from amazon prime you fucking dogs God, I thought Cheeky it would be bastards. fun. I thought we'd have some creative freedom with this Borat video. My they God. said, do, make it edgy. That's what they said. It says it in the brief. They Police said, make it edgy. Is edgy. God, and then we do that and there's, eh, sorry, Amazon's liable. Fuck off. We're liable. We're the ones who did it. You told us to do it. Oh. Anyway. Next question. So, if you want to really support us, guys. Go to our website because that's pretty much what we're doing. And we know the website's website's fucking slow as shit at the moment because of all the bloody videos on there. But we're moving everything to the app. We don't know when the app's going to be done. That's another thing where it's just obstacle after obstacle. We have to like sync up the Stripe account, sync up the ClickFunnels, all this tedious, time-consuming shit. So I don't know when it's going to be out ready. It's 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 live in the App Store, but you can't do anything. So don't bother downloading it yet. So yeah, I don't, it's hopefully a month. That's what the time frame I've been given. Hopefully a month. So probably, ho- real probably realistically, maybe like six or seven weeks. Sorry, know. guys. We're trying our best. We're not fucking experts in the yeah. tech world we're and learn- all this business shit. We're all learning as we go. And um, yeah, I know. Just try and put up with the uh, the speed of the website. It was never meant to have this much content on it. It was all meant to be switched over to the app by now. And the server's getting real slow and clogged up because there's just so much fucking, so many videos on there now. Just hang in there for us, guys. Well, next year, we've got some rad shit planned. Yeah, we're going to This to- fucking 2020 has been so raped. Yeah, it has not been fucking fun, that's for sure. Oh, man. Anyway, we've got Toka tonight. We do. Marty's out, though. Yeah, we play this game with the tennis mixed with soccer, and that's sort of my fucking release now. So, I'm going to look forward to that, and we're going to get our uh, next segment on, which is called Shot, and it's where we answer questions from you guys. Marty, Would you like to go first, Michael. Wait, no, Matt. Me? Have you got the? I don't. I didn't get questions because I thought we'd That's just right. go and shorten it now. Three, but um, but they're all pretty quality. So let's have a look. Mm. Um, all right, I've got one from Anton. Um, I cannot pronounce the last name. It looks like Amakanian. Amakanian. Yeah, that's it. That's exactly right. Thank you. Mm. Um, would you rather to be able to only drink backwashed water from random people or only be able to consume water by chewing ice? Ice, for sure. Yeah. Fuck, yeah. You get also, you'd, you'd die probably. Well, you'd probably get some infections of some kind. 100%. Well, what about the ice? Well, you see people that get like stranded, stranded in the snow. It's, yeah, but they're not allowed to eat it because it lowers their body temperature. But yeah. if you live in Australia, you just fucking... I'll just have a block of ice, let, let it sit in your mouth, let it melt, and then fucking... Okay. Yeah, I'd go ice too. Question for Martin from Lad. His name's Lad. Fuck yeah, come on. Um, could you say just one, only one German word? Arschloch. Schmetterling. Oh, what's that mean? Schmetterling means butterfly. No, <laughs> Kotoffa Cave. Oh, wait. No, Kotoffa Cave is potato bug. Um, Kugelschreiber. <laughs> Can I just point something out? Michael's becoming more German as this season's podcast has gone on. He's uh, been coming up with a lot more words. I have got a little crush on it, I must and I say. I want to know it's what's like going a, on. It's like a, a crush you sort of hate. You sort of bully. So I like bully the German society, but I really do love it deep down. It's just that they need to speak. It's so strange when you hear her fucking speak in German. It's it's fucking un- unbelievable. You've seen it. You've seen it on here. It's unbelievable. It's incredible noises. H- how do you say fly in German? Flieger. <laughs> <laughs> that is oh. so fucked up. Oh, Flieger. Oh, Flieger. <laughs> Fuck off, Flieger. <laughs> Flieger. <laughs> Oh, I laughed so hard I went dizzy and my hemorrhoid hurt. Oh, oh fuck. look at this. I've made a, um, a row of teeth with uh, the blue tag while you guys were talking. Whoa, it looks like a vampire teeth. Put it on there. 
<laughs> Holy shit, you're That's an good, artist. Oh, <laughs> real. How did you do that? I've just been uh, patiently um, working at that for a while. Mm. <laughs> Next question is from Nikki. Um, question for the podcast. Can you please reveal your favorite vehicle uh, from this list and why? Horse. Number one, broomstick. Number two, a giant turtle. Number three, being carried around like a baby by Marty, respectfully, or by Michael, if it's the other. Is a, a broomstick a flying broomstick? Yeah, I guess so. This girl's German, by the way. Shout out to her. Or I've seen her comment before. Flieger. <laughs> Number four, 20 cockroaches under each foot. I'd go the broomstick. That's fucking... Yeah, broomstick. And then you can like, go on. Do you be in between people's crotches? When? When they're fucking flying you. Imagine that. Is this what we want to be? No, this is what you want to choose as your mode of transport. Oh, yeah. Broomstick. Oh, I was really? Just, I'd even be a broomstick. Fuck, I'll go that giant turtle. You ever seen Nemo? I'll be that cool dude. Yeah, but turtle. you can't bloody breathe it's underwater, It's so slow. Mate. It's so slow. In and out. He's, he's fine. They can go in and out of the water. No, you want to fly like Harry. Yeah, and then yeah, you can maybe. fly your broomstick into the water and then back out. You can yeah. do the same thing, but it's much faster. The broomstick shit. You can't fly a broomstick underwater. Yes, yeah. you can. Oh, oh my God. 100% you can. I used to I used to know a guy. <coughs> Serious. Oh, I don't know. It needs to be tested. Yeah, well, broomstick. Maybe we should test that. Can broomsticks really fly? Yeah, can broomsticks really fly? And you can go underwater, see if it flies. Fuck, that's not a bad idea. I'm Thanks, writing that man. down. Write that one down. Look at this. I've now done the um, bottom jaw with the, with the teeth here. If you guys want to have a quick little look. Um, You're going to put them in? Oh, look, it's uh, falling apart a little bit, but uh, yeah. I'm know. writing this idea down. This is fucking... I can see that there. That is a good on idea. On YouTube. So, that's the Science upper experiment. upper jaw there. Connor cut me saying this is a good idea. I didn't enjoy it. Upper teeth here and then the lower jaw down there. So, you can see the canines and then the uh, four little middle teeth there. Anyway, what do you guys like to do in your spare time? Comment below. Broomsticks. <laughs> <laughs> Fly. All right, next ringworm. All right, next ringworm is um, oh, he's a regular. Um, I can never pronounce Uncris twenty seventeen. He's a um, he's a question reg- for the podcast. Yeah, he regularly posts something. He said my threes are getting old. Oh, 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 oh. That hurt Matt's feelings. Oh, <laughs> and he's hemorrhoid. I'm hemorrhoiding. <laughs> yeah. Uh, question for the podcast: Why does Marty's fart sound so tight? Because I have a special technique, I guess. I don't know. It's it's a learnt skill. Many. It's fucking interesting. He pulls the cheeks apart and then tightens his anus. It's fucked up. It's like a picture of uh, when you when you blow up a balloon and you you and let you the air and you out. pull the neck sideways. You pull the neck of the balloon sideways as you're letting the air out. It makes a high pitched sound. That's what I do. <laughs> you saying neck pissed me off a bit there. <laughs> neck neck. You know how you say neck in German? <laughs> Hals. <laughs> That's right. We always used to say it. Hals. We'd play Monopoly virtually on the fucking Xbox. <laughs> Just press A over and over again, staying up till 4 a.m. saying Hals. And that's when we were diagnosed with severe autism. <laughs> Hals. 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 H-A-L-Z. Hals. It's such a weird, weird word. <laughs> fuck him. And we convinced the guy we were playing with that we wanted to fuck him. <laughs> yeah, Philip. He was a German exchange student. <laughs> and, we get, and we kept fucking like flirting pretend, with each other. Pretending that we were going to start making out. And we're like pressuring him to kiss us and shit. Started touching his leg. No, 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 I don't want to. <laughs> no, no, I don't know. <laughs> He just fucking was. He never slept over again. We fucked him. That's why. (laughs) We didn't fuck him, but he thought we wanted to. Wait, he's a German exchange student from school. Yeah, he was in the tennis program with us, and then we convinced him to sleep over. And we were obsessed with (laughs) playing Monopoly on Xbox because we couldn't be fucked doing all the workings out. We gotta push the things. Mm, Rolling a dice shits me too. Anyway, that's Philip. You're probably watching, mate. We fucked you. Mm. Hals. <laughs> <laughs> oh. um, all right, next question uh, is from Jake Osborne. Will you ever go traveling to meet fans or do shows or anything? Yeah, oh. Of course, when's, when we're allowed to. We can't really do much at the moment. But yeah, we've been 
we were meant to travel all year this year, but we couldn't. So as soon as the borders reopen, we'll we'll definitely be looking to go back to America and fucking just around Australia. I guess we could go around Australia. We, yeah, well, you know what? We'll go around Australia next year. We just gotta we just gotta fucking figure out how to get all these videos under control because it's just too much. I'm yeah, so fucking hell, that. man. Just no wonder Matt's getting hemorrhoids. Look at all the videos we have to pump out. <laughs> fucking hell. <laughs> you have a, a lump on your bum hole I feel like I, I'm, I'm pretty tempted to title this episode Matt has <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh yeah it makes sense too yeah, oh. right. that's fair <laughs> <laughs> um oh shit <laughs> um, oh, fuck. and my girlfriend's been doing the same jokes to me as well. He, he hates sitting down. How's your bum bum? Oh, really? Yeah, picks on me. How's your bum bum? Yeah, she oh. thinks it's funny. <laughs> How's your bottom? Mm. That's the the right way. How of big is it? it? Like a pea size? You or? have to show no, us. It's a bit bigger. You have Ma- to fucking marble. show us. Mm. Would you? Okay, I'll give you fifty bucks if I can touch it. <laughs> Come on. That's pretty good. I'll put in 50 for that. 100 100 bucks and I get to touch it. On this podcast, we'll do it, but not facing away. You just have to face the camera with your eyes. I will call And I'll softly touch it. I'll softly touch it. You don't even have to do it on camera. Just do it off camera and I will commentate that. Look, I'll rip my nail off so it won't scratch it and it won't bleed. Because it's a bit long at the moment. You put a bit of tissue on his finger so he can just touch it through the (laughs) tissue. $100, man. Please. Come on, man. Hundred bucks, dude! Come on, come Next on. Next question. Put some oh, cream on. He's 200. so against it. Final offer: two hundred dollars. We'll do it. Two hundred dollars? No. Oh, what? Oh man! I'd do that for free. I'd pay you to touch mine. <laughs> I have before. I will again. My name is Ben. <laughs> Disco dun, 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 dancing. Oh, I think this is the last question. I'll double check though. From Jacob Borders: um, Would you rather die from drowning or from fire? Drowning. Drowning. I almost did. Go back to the podcast number one, the first story we ever did. You'll hear this storm water drain story. I've almost drowned like three times. Burning would suck. Burning oh. would be so painful. We tried to, and sorry about our website. We, well, we, we did it. We got a website video. When you li- if you're listening to this now, uh, website members, it's the website exclusive video that came out last Wednesday. We tried to give each other a tattoo with a magnifying glass. It's impossible. Fucking impossible. You can't, as soon, within four seconds, the mag, the light that shines through the magnifying glass was burning the skin. And you just, like, even if you fight through it for a, a while, it's just a very small little red mark. So, it's like it's, fucking impossible. Yeah, and it, it was just too painful. For anything burn fire related is shit. It's too fucking, we learned that from one of our first vids we did when we played with fire. It's dangerous as fuck. I almost got like lit up because we didn't, the fire extinguisher didn't work. And like, it's just, I don't want to ever fuck with fire or burning shit again. Yeah. And like you're you left all disfigured and shit if you do survive. Well, at least if you're drowning, you're, you're this close to death and then you do survive a drowning, you're fine. You just get out of the water and cough up a bit of piss and then you move on. But with burning, you, you that scars you for life, man. Is that why you look like? Nothing. Oh. I'm Aww. just joking, Matt. <laughs> I'm just kidding, Matt. I'm sorry. Oh, Let me touch it. your hemorrhoid. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my brown. My brown. You're my Matthew Brown. All right, let's tell you secrets time. Woo. Is there no more questions? No, that's everything. Sorry. There's probably someone on Instagram, but um, should we just do them on YouTube from now on? Yeah, that's yeah. what I've told people. I want to push it to YouTube. Then Because okay, oh, then we can more comment. If you want to send in secrets, guys, send them to our Instagram and yeah, I'll yeah, take so, care yeah. of it. So, secrets to Instagram, questions to, on our YouTube, fully, Marty and Michael, fully actual pod, YouTube channel. <laughs> this podcast is sponsored by the University of Mark. You already know, okay? Just... You already know. Actually, if you want to see some decent content from us guys. Oh, yeah. Look, what we found we found our old... Oh, fuck. I can't believe I forgot to tell you this. We found a hard drive with lots of our old TV show fucking segments on there. We used to have... Back in the day, years ago, we had this really shitty local TV show. And we did some stupid shit on that. And we got, actually got kicked off of air. So we weren't even on there for, for a full season. We were kicked off of air for just We're being a bit, boys. bit too fucked up. 
And we're posting those um, for the next month, I think. It's four episodes on every Sunday on the website. So, it's some oh, fucking... Oh, this is the tit challenge? Mm. Yeah, tit mm. challenge. Yeah. yeah. Um, and our TikTok is fucking banging. We are lost in the bush. Yeah, I can't believe it. But we it. come here for the podcast like some... Oh, this is in the bush. Yeah, we set Matt came to us. See, it's And then the he bush. keeps us there. And we've got like a little bush series of being lost there. And fuck me, has some drama happened. <laughs> Stephen, Stephen Hawking's is evil. It turns He's out. a fucking psychopath. Watch it on our TikTok, guys. It's fucking intense. Yeah, for some ex content if you want. If you need it, you know. All right, here we go. We'll go with some secrets. Okay. This one's from... Oh, we can't really... We won't fucking tell you who it's from because this is anonymous. It's safe to send, guys. All right, the bank put up 100K in my account six years ago and I went on a huge bender and never got done. That's Wow, never wow. got done. That's so fucking cool. You Imagine hear that, that shit all the time. Banks are like, that happens a bit. Wasn't there some dude who went on Willem's podcast? Yep. Saying that he was fucking- he could, Unlimited card. He'd just keep at a certain time at a certain uh, ATM, ATM. He could fucking get an unlimited cash out and then just spend it. And the only reason he got done is because he turned himself in. He turned himself in. Man, the banks fuck us every day. Never, ever- ever give yourself into a bank or even the, uh, the police if you've done something wrong never hand yourself in because if there's a chance of getting away with it why not take it unless you've killed or raped someone I guess. yeah yeah unless it's something bad but any petty crimes fuck it but like, anyway, anyway everyone the new banking bank called Lannister get around it because we're going to be promoting the shit out of that that was good promo all right, this one. Now, this is fucking intense. This guy's got some stories. Okay. I owe a drug dealer 4K, not for drugs I borrowed, cash, and another person 4K who's fuming. It's two weeks late and all due Monday, and I don't have 100 quid to my name. Sleepless nights, boys. Fuck ah. that. That's a rough situation. Man. Oh, man. Yeah. Sorry, dude. Drug-related debt is the worst, probably. Yeah, fuck me. It would probably be so shit. We've all been there. Oh, damn, boy. <laughs> all right. Another secret from the same person. This guy's full of them. Both think I have it on Monday. Oh, this is added on to it. Nobody knows and I'm just getting twatted every night so I don't think about it. Deep, huh? Need a loan. Oh God, that is fucking intense. So, yeah, he's, he's yeah, he's fucking, man stressful if we think we've got it bad fuck imagine him right now yeah, right. we should be grateful matt you've got a hemorrhoid be grateful i wish i had one i'd swap my life for that right now anyway yeah, from right. the same dude i was racking coke in the toilets through the entire wedding of my two be two of my best mates weddings everyone's done that i took coke and pills through my entire 10-year relationship with my ex-wife without her knowledge Jesus. How? She must have been dumb. <laughs> yeah, dude, that's intense. Fuck. All right. I once took a blue Nike in town and was overdosing, so I lied to my best mate that I had been spiked and he got a speeding fine racing to help me. Oh, my God. <laughs> is it the same guy? This is all the same guy. And then he's like, I don't actually have a drug problem, but these stories make me sound like I uh, do. It definitely sounds like you got some issues there, man. <laughs> Fucking hell. All right, this one's another one from a different person. One time I was over my family's house and one of my cousins cousins was so fucking horny, I'm guessing. I'm 11 years old at the time and she was in her early 20s. She took my virginity that day. Fuck Ever off. since then, I haven't had good sex or have enjoyed it. Fuck off. So but imagine if it was real. That's crazy. Man. This is a 20 year old. She's a fucking pedophile. She needs to be in jail. 11 years old. How do you know it might have been a dude? I, I didn't even... Oh, yeah. I, yeah, well, that's even worse then, isn't it? I, yeah, I didn't apparently. even have a dick when I was 11. Yeah, I didn't even know about sex and shit My, until I was like, what, 18, 20? I only had testicles when I was like 14 and then the dick came around 16 years old. <laughs> <laughs> like right. bloomers, you guys. Now, this one's from a different person. I took my dad's police car vehicle out for a drive to go out to the pub oh, yes. and drive home afterwards. I may add I was fucked and I didn't get pulled over to... He was on holidays. Yeah, of course you can get pulled over. You're in a cop, cop car. Cars don't get pulled over. Uh, cop cars. Unless he was all over the road. Yeah, and they just put the sirens on and say you're chasing. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I've got a confession. Chasing. 
Oh, yes. My dad had a BMW when I was a bit younger, when I was like 16. Yeah. And uh, he went away for like a couple of days and I don't know where my sister was, but I had access to the car. <laughs> and so, I I think I drove it to school and I took it to a party and you just were cool because I had a BMW. I thought it was the best thing ever. Oh, my God. <laughs> and I came, he came home and I think it was about 10 minutes of him being home. He must have went straight in and checked the odometer. <laughs> and he's like... You took you took the car out, didn't you? And I was oh. like, <laughs> and I was like, no, no, I didn't. And he's like, he's like, you lying to me? I'm like, no, nah, I didn't. And he goes, well, there's a hundred k's on it. And I was like, I didn't not do a hundred k's, but I must have. <laughs> maybe maybe your sister took it out. Maybe as well. Th- that's a fucking high possibility. And I remember going. He goes, you lied to me. And he was like coming after me. And I I remember running and like diving under my bed to try and get away from him and he fucked and you he, <laughs> and he, 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 stuck and he fucked you he's just cause i thought he was gonna hit me and I, I remember his hand like under there trying to get at me <laughs> <laughs> trying to finger your little hemorrhoid asshole brother <laughs> i'm gonna make it bleed <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh that's hot i like that story uh, that matthew is, brown that, is, that, that was a little a, high school story that is a storyline of so many pornos and my sister doesn't know but i took her car out a few times too. i, I took all their cars out a few times fucking but hell. never got caught never crashed them i was a good boy have i never t- ever took my parents cars out me mm. either have you ever taken our cars out oh, man i've got um fun. yeah i took your car once and i drove to the shops yeah w- with our consent got some food no no it was our consent marty was asleep oh okay i've been out oh my god yeah sorry man this is a secret i jack off to jackson's missus at least once a week <laughs> <laughs> Hey, I'm I, telling Jackson on you. Yeah, yeah. That, that had happened so much. Well, I guess yeah, she's well, on only she, only she's, fans. She's she's in porn, so I guess that's sort of her job is to be wanked over. Mm. She makes mm. blokes. I have sex with my friend's mum on the regular basis. We have been doing this for about a year, and she is married, and I have known him since grade seven. We fucked. are thirty now. That is that's fucked, fucked up, man. Imagine that. Imagine if I was just drilling Matt's mum. Oh, as hard as you could. Since since I met him. Julie! Matt Julie! Oh, 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 oh. Just fucking her as hard as you can from behind and she's begging you to stop. Please stop. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, Mrs. Brown. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, oh, Brown. Oh, Brown. Chock top. Oh, chock top, Brown. (laughs) (laughs) Oh. Oh, yeah. All right. His next hemorrhoid one. just tripled in size. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Next one. I was in high school like three years ago. I was flirting with my teacher. She's 20 years older oh, than me. Oh, here we go. Yes. We had sex a lot of times and she's my mum's friend. Oh, let's- let's Wait, uh, that's hot. Let's expose him. Can we go back? How, <laughs> let's get her thrown in jail. How please. old was he when he had sex with her? He was seven years old. Three years ago. So, he would have been like 16, 15. And he's drilling his teacher. Fuck, yeah. that happens so much more than you realize. Yeah. <laughs> I would, imagine if a teacher came. I wouldn't have known what to do. I would have just... I was so oh. immature in high school. Such a sick little fucking snake cunt. <laughs> <laughs> you were a silly, silly Billy. You were such a silly Billy. I wouldn't even know how to fuck nothing cunt. <laughs> Oh, I never had any hot teachers. God. I slept with my cousin's wife two weeks after their honeymoon. Oh, cousin man. still has no idea about that it. So no funny. idea if I should tell him. Yes, that that you a cunt. That person is a cunt. That who does that? Fucks his cousin's missus right after they get married. And his cousin's missus is also a fucking scumbag. What a man. F- there you these, go. Some of these secrets. Oh, my God. We shouldn't judge. We're getting him to send in entertainment. Yeah, we don't want to Good job, mate. Anyway, no, they're away. sending them in to be judged. Mm, Marty and Michael. All right. <sighs> That's too much reading for me. I lived with a guy in Spain who caught jacking it to an amputee porn on the sitting room couch. He moved out within a week. A dude on my school who microwaved then fucked a banana and told people... I also lived with another guy who we caught flushing the toilet with his head in it. First few times we thought he was throwing up. Third time he was filming himself. He used to hang pictures of nudie girls from adult magazines up on my, my wall when I was a teen. And my mother's cousin, who I barely knew, came over, home from, um, came over from England one Christmas and found his daughter's tit, tits on the wall above my bed. 
I've rusty hooked a girl during doggy without her realizing. What's that? What's rusty I'm, hooked? I think you like- I'm on it. Shove it in your ass. So, you got shit on your fingers. Oh. And then you go- Oh, oh that is fucked. No, that no. is fucked. How do people come up with this shit? Dude, there's a, a lot of A friend of mine shit. had a cum cap under his bed, which was basically a baseball cap he shot his load into for five years. <laughs> I wonder what the cap would look like. I had a rubber pussy. We'd be pussy. so crustified. I had a rubber pussy when I was younger and slashed it into the panels of the bathroom at home. Oh, this is good. This Stashed one. it in the panels of the bathtub at home. That is fuck the Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then look. The cum cap? Wonder what that would look like. Oi, if you're listening to this person who sent that in, send us a photo of the cum cap. I'd love to see what that looks like. <laughs> that is a good science experiment. And then his mum stashed it in yeah, yeah, in ten years. So now nearly ten years later, so that dude who put that that fucking what what was it? Cum cap. No, the fucking rubber pussy in oh, the oh, in the sorry. bathroom. So he's hidden it in the tiles, right? Ten years later, his mum's had the fucking bathroom redone. Had the plumber come over and sent a photo of it. To oh, her. that's fucking awkward. Oh man, that is so good. Um, definition of the rusty hook. Yeah, I think it's similar to what you said. Hook occurs when the length of the index finger is inserted into the anus, extracted, and placed on the inside of someone's mouth, thus hooking their cheek. <laughs> How much would you do that for? A bit of corn. How much? Okay. No. Come on. Let me ask you a question. <laughs> no, ah, I know what the question yeah. is. Stop it. <laughs> I haven't even said yeah, it yet. Yeah, but I can read you. What do you reckon? You want to touch my hemorrhoid and stick it in your mouth like a hook. <laughs> All right. Here's you can. Oh, so what would you rather? You can either let me squeeze your hemorrhoid till it bursts. Ah. Or you do get they a, do that? Do they burst? What are they? they we should try and burst you. No. How much? Pair of pliers. No. Okay. All right. That or you get rusty hooked by me for a week (laughs) every day. And it's there's shit on there. Like I fucking get shit on my fingers. No. Come Come on, on, man. Show us your fucking balls. <laughs> yeah. Show me your balls. Show us something. Give us a dick shot or a ball. Give us something, Or the fucking Matt. third one on your ass. Your fucking pink balls. I want to see them and touch it. <laughs> oh, just let us fill you up. Come here. Oh, just show us your ass. You don't have to show us your asshole. Just pull your pants down and show us the ass. Come on, Please. man. All right. Come on. Yes. Oh, sit back and relax. Oh, yeah. Here comes the show. You guys are mm. sick. Matthew Brown. Yeah, look at the wig I'm wearing, cunt. No, you think I'm, I'm no normal? One ha- huh? You think I'm You're normal? You're not doing anything. You think I'm the fucking normal? has been shit for us. Give us a little treat. Oh, oh yes. Mm. Will you show us that? Will you be, no. be extra treasure? Mm, Will you be extra no. treasure, please? I want to see it so bad. Come on, you fucking <laughs> slut. <laughs> No. Oh, oh, we pushed him too hard. Oh, we were so close. He stood too up. Too eager. He had his pants down. Fuck. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. I was so excited. Then that would have fixed my day. Look what you've done. You've destroyed me. <laughs> you fucking destroyed me. Oh. Maybe show at Toka. You can show all the boys. We'll have a laugh. No. Okay. Uh, It's mine. I'm backing off. I'm backing off. One of my biggest secrets is one night me and my cousins and a couple of our friends went out drinking and we got so shit faced that me and my friend Andrew. Oh, shit. Well, we we won't say his last name. The last ones. Bravo! Bravo! Oh, see? That's all you had to do. He even made music. He didn't have to do that. I can't I do made that. A song. It'll hurt. <laughs> he made a song. I made your song, Matthew Brown. <laughs> a sweet ballad. <laughs> 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 All right, so him and his friend Andrew stayed up, right? Everyone's passed out. The last ones to go to bed. So since everyone passed out, my friend Andrew pissed on one of our other friends and I farted on Johnny's face. 
The next morning, Johnny had pink eye and my what? friend Mike woke up in wet jeans <laughs> thinking he'd pissed himself. <laughs> That's the best prank. Imagine pissing on your mate passed out in his crutch area and then in the morning, he thinks he pissed himself, <laughs> but it's someone else's piss. Yeah, I'm doing that. Good. That is good <laughs> shit. That's a fucking good prank. That's my favorite secret. Anyway, keep those secrets coming, guys. Yeah, good more shit. secrets. Send them to our Instagram. <sighs> Fucking good shit. Do we have a stunt time? Yeah, it's pouring lemon juice into Michael's eyes. All right, sweet. Our next segment is called Stunt Time. I didn't think about that. I'm so scared, dude. Do you know how fucking much this burns? Really? Okay. It's not going to be fun. Try and yeah, I didn't want to. I didn't, he just made that up then. <laughs> Try, I didn't even think I was doing this. Try and drink it with your eyes. Okay. Maybe if you eat one of those berries first, it won't hurt so much. Yeah, okay. actually, that's my reward. Remember. We're well, filming man. a video of these tomorrow. We're oh, going yeah. to we're gonna eat lots of sick shit. <laughs> oh, he's twitchy. He's a vocler. Ah! Ah! No! No! It's fucking too much. Hurry, get it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wipe it off with this. Wipe it off with this. No, you, you got something bad. No, please. No, I need something, Matt. Matt. <laughs> Matt. Please. Matt. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's getting worse. Yeah, 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 yeah. Matt, yeah. do you want to see my hammer? Yeah. Oh, Matt. my God. It's no. huge. No. It's fucking no. massive, Matt. I know you guys are lying. Oh, that is pretty. Oh I like God. the colors around the rim of it. Oh, my God. Fucking what's that going on? That is massive. What's that? Oh. It's bigger than the ones it's you had more. for sure. Here. Fuck you, dude. Yeah, here, use that. Ah. Ah. Oh no! Oh. No! Do you want a glass of water? No, I Watch just fucking want. Take your headphones off for a sec. No. You sure? Get him uh, one of those uh, pieces of clothing. I there. just want toilet paper. Fuck! Oh, yeah, that one will do nicely, bro. This is what I'm lost in in TikTok world. Oh, what is this? It's a shirt covered in urine and lemon. <laughs> All right, that's stunt time this week. Ha, ah, take that. <laughs> oh, yeah, you look like you've been fingered. You missed the hemorrhoid. Yeah. Oh, my God. There's so many pretty colors around the outside. It's like a rainbow. All right, for our final for our final segment, I'm not doing the uh, segment name changes this week. And yeah, I'm sorry. I didn't do the on this days either, guys. Just fucking, it's, it's, uh, it's hard to be funny right now. What was that? A tear. Oh, wow. I threw a tear it on you. It burns my skin. It's so evil. <laughs> you need holy water, cunt. All right, for the prank call this week, we're going to call Michael's mum and pretend that Michael wants to fuck her. <laughs> Let's call Greg again. I want to fuck with him. Uh, we, we really got to start... I we thought, got plan I thought to myself, fuck, we should probably plan a prank call before we do it. I didn't even... Yeah, I always think until we're actually here in this moment. Should we Should we fucking just... I'll just type in a random number and call. Yeah. Uh, Chris, do you... Made a dick? Uh, hello, uh, Chris is fish, yes? Yeah. Yeah, my name uh, Arnold. Uh, I recently uh, catch uh, maybe five, six very large fish. Um, I'm looking to sell. You buy fish? Uh, who's I think the price is already like sorted out. Who's who supply your fish? Huh? You tell me. Uh, I I don't know. You'd have to ask the boss. Is uh, the boss in? No, he probably won't be back until five thirty. Uh, uh, can you make a note for the boss? You write this down, yes? I can try. I can't guarantee he'll call back. Though. Yeah, that's no worries. I'm pretty sure he called back when he hear my price. Explain. An eel as well. All right, so you write this down, yes? Yeah. I have uh, six large fish. Uh, fish it is? Uh, yes, I think um, barracuda. Barracuda or barramundi, or both, I think. Maybe a little both. Uh, one is very heavy. One I can't even lift myself. One I need two men to lift. Two whole big men to lift. Right, at least 50, 60 kilo. Huh? You hear me? You write that down, 50, 60 kilo, that number. I sell you premium fish. It's on ice right now. I look and eat it. Right on ice in the freezer right now. I sell you 50, 60 kilo of a barracuda. Mm, $400. Okay? That one fish will last your shop four weeks. I promise. Hmm? 
You hear? You write that down? Four weeks that one lasts. Uh, that's only one fish. We have a barramundi. Mwah. Unbelievable flavor. Mm. They're still flicking around on the boat. They're still living. So they're still so fresh. And I'll put them on ice right now. Hala! Hala, go put that one on ice. Put it on ice with the others. Yes. Uh, that's uh, two now. And the other four, big fish. 20 to 30 kilo. I lift myself, but still very heavy. They take me three, four hour catch. Hmm? You understand? You write that down. Three, four hour. And so all together, roughly maybe 150 kilo of fish. Mwah. Fresh. Straight on ice. Mmm. Lying there. A couple still flicking around. I sell you all 150 kilo. Mmm. Six, seven hundred dollar. You make me an offer, huh? You tell him make me an offer. Oh, he <laughs> fucking hung up. <laughs> Dude, he's, he's my new favorite character. I want you to be him. I want you to be that guy. He's so bad. He's so good. I love it. He's still flicking <laughs> I wonder how much of that he actually wrote down. <laughs> I bet you he wrote the first bit down, the 50 to 60 kilo or whatever. I'm not, wasn't sure what type it was. Barracuda or barramundi. A bit of both. <laughs> oh, that one had me in stitches. That's, I reckon that's my favourite one yet. That's my most favourite, dude. <laughs> you write that down. I'll <laughs> 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 see you guys next week. Oh, yeah, we're not really the best this week. Oh, uh, it's been it's not been the best day, but we are the best. <laughs> you write that down. You write that down. <laughs> we are the best. You write that down. Oh, <laughs> fucking hell, dude.